Hey BG family, this is your backyard gardener. I got to go on this hive today because I need to find out if I need to add a, a super, another deep, I'm sorry, another deep on here, which is another box for them to put their brood and their, uh, for themselves. I want to go two deep high, and I also have to um, mess around with this entrance reducer and put it on a larger setting because it's starting to get a little hot. Got a lot of bees inside my thing. I'm checking the top to make sure none of them is the queen that's hanging out up here. Sean, go get that box out of the uh, that other deep I bought. They're going through this uh, sugar water pretty good, but at this point, I'm going to start winging them off of here. Because we have enough uh, pollen in the area for them to start bringing in naturally. Uh, so this might be their last feeding for me. And after that... They'll start bringing in their own pollen. So we're going to take, do a good inspection as far as making sure uh, the queen is not in any of this equipment that I'm taking off right now. I don't see her on the top of anything as well. Remember, the queen had the, just sit it on the ground right there, babe. The queen has the blue dot on her. And she shouldn't be hanging out up here, but you never know. So you just, it's just precaution. Uh, this is almost stuck to my box. It is, actually. <coughs> Where's my hive to? Thank you. And that could be for different reasons, this stuff to there. Sugar. Sugar. So they're pretty active. <coughs> and that could be a a good thing and kind of a bad thing. I got my smoker going really good. The reason for that is because I'm going deep into this hive and not just adding. Okay, that's my stuff, so that's a good thing. <coughs> The smoke, smoking me out. Uh, I'll look on my top real good. See if I see my queen. I don't. Uh, I'm gonna check this box pretty thoroughly for two reasons: to make sure. Everything is going as planned. You can hear the the bee uh, sound. What I'm looking for is I need eight of these frames to be filled. It's a 10 frame deep, but I need eight to be filled before I add my other deep on here. And sometimes getting these frames out of here can be really tricky.
even with the high tool. One thing you don't want to do is hurt your queen. So when taking these boxes out, you got to be gentle. Taking out these frames, excuse me. Coming up and going down in them. Because there's a terminology called rolling the queen. Meaning smashing them, pretty much. This one is looking good. I'm going to take it. I don't see the queen on there. And I'm going to lay it on the ground because I don't have my frame holder. I ordered one, but everything is uh, slow. Let me tell you something about this. Back hurt for real. You will get some back aches. Because you're doing a lot of bending over. And these things... They're kind of heavy. You want to you wanna remember how you take your frame out. <sighs> Looks good. A lot of capped off brew cone. See this right here. I can really pull that off of there. Give you a closer look. Go all that honey in that. <clears throat> but this is not honey for me. This is honey for them. Right, we're gonna flag that back in there. Slowly. Ah. So yeah. Uh, you will go through some back problems. I think in about another week, I'll add my deep. Because they're just not getting into it. From what I can see. So maybe another week. I'll add that deep, that second deep box on here. I'm gonna be really slow. Give them a chance to get out of your way. You wanna put these frames right back in the order that you got them out. Very important as well. want to move slow again so that you don't roll your queen if it's over in this area. There we go. So I did my inspection. I didn't look for the queen. <clears throat> but she's in here or they would have swarmed. They would have went somewhere else. Sometimes you can tell just where the queen is, too. By where, I'm, where most of the bees, and she's probably right in this area. Give you guys a close-up of how they're working this whole box. That's a beautiful sound. So hold on one second.